see how bright it is right now? I can't, I'm squinting with my sunglasses, but that's not what we're here for. Right there is what many people are calling a sunshade. And if you go on Amazon and search for RV sunshade, you will find something just like this in different sizes than my size, but you will find that there is nothing under a hundred bucks. I'm going to show you what I did for $40. Stay tuned. So this is not going to be a very long video because there really isn't a giant secret here. But if you can see, my travel trailer is 24 feet. My awning, I believe, is 13 feet long. And we are on the side where the sun sets. So after 12 o'clock, we start to get the sun hitting the side of the trailer. And if we want to sit in here, either we're going to sweat because we're in Florida, or the sun is going to be in our eyes. So I went about my business to find something of a sunshade that I've seen other people use. And, uh, but I did not want to spend $150, which is what I saw on Amazon, for a sunshade. Now I'm going to apologize for the wind. It is extremely windy here. Gusts of 25 miles an hour. We're camping here in Lake Wales, Florida as I film this. But let me show you how to save at least a hundred bucks. Right here, heavy duty knitted mesh tarp, 10 by 12, which is more or less perfect for my size awning. Where did I get this? Believe it or not, folks, Harbor Freight. What did I pay for it? A whopping $29.99 right there at Harbor Freight, 10 by 12 mesh. And if I walk over to the mesh, I, it's not thick like crazy thick. I can see through it, but it is definitely blocking some of the sun. If you see the difference between here and there, you can see it does provide some shade. It's got grommets all over. And what I've done, I'll show you the other side, but I just take a couple of camping stakes and stake it down and I make sure that it's kind of tight which is actually helping today in the wind. And then I will show you the inside here. I have these clips, which they make for holding lights. But if you have the grommet here, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven grommets. If you have the grommets, then why can't you use this for your own RV shade? And that literally is it. These, I think you can get eight of them on Amazon for $8.99 or $9.99. And there you have a $40 sunshade. Now, maybe it's not the same quality as what's on Amazon. I couldn't tell you because I wasn't about to spend $120, $130, $140. But you can see the whole thing here. And with today, with today's wind, it's actually helping me because I have the, the awning is a couple of clicks downwards and then I have this tight and this is actually helping secure my awning. So that's a little added bonus. Hey, do me a favor. If this is the kind of content you like, hit the smash that thumbs up button. That's the best way to help our little channel grow. That is the whole thing, folks. That's my $40 sunshade and it has been working all weekend because the sun has been out, although it's been windy, the sun has been out every day. This is our third day here at this campsite. And right around one o'clock, the sun starts hitting our trailer. And instead of being chased inside, I have my $40 sunshade. That's the whole video, folks. Show me a little love, thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't. Hit the notification bar if you wanna be notified of other videos and there you have it so thanks for watching may your shade be a little bit better than no shade at all see you on the next one